The Bald Eagle. A symbol of great inspiration and patriotism. So it is here, on the banks of the great Mississippi River, that we gather to celebrate these beautiful creatures. Every year these winged animals make their way south to it when the weather gets cold and the waters freeze over. They make their way to Wabashaw, Minnesota. And the National Eagle Center. Some of the human impact on the eagles are in the killing, trapping, and poisoning of them. The biggest hurdle of the eagles has been the widespread use of DDT, a powerful pesticide that has been banned in the United States since 1972, with three eagles that live there in the center year-round. Angel, Columbia, who was named after the space shuttle tragedy, and Harriet. They come down to this part of the country in search of food. Their primary source of food is fish. They prefer gizzard shad, which are plentiful in the rivers in this area. Eagles can cruise at about 40 miles an hour, but their strong wings allow them to reach speeds of up to 60 miles an hour. If it is really necessary, they can make dives of up to 100 miles an hour. Their long, powerful wings act as flight sensors, detecting minute changes in wind speed and direction, sending the signals up through the wings and changing their flight muscles. That can The female eagle is generally about 25 to 30 percent larger than the males. Their coloration makes them hard to distinguish from one another. While I was visiting the ANEC, I met a volunteer named Joan. She wrote me into helping out a female eagle that we had at the beach named Angel. I had to help put Angel back in her cage while she was at the beach. I also assisted in bringing the cage back to the center. While I was talking to Joan, she told me that the, an adult eagle can live into their 30s in the proper environment. However, 80% of the younger eagles do not reach their second birthday. Many of them are hit by cars while feeding on carcasses, tempting their first flights, or eating poison foods. Their talons consist of two-inch large, razor-sharp claws. It has been said that with one determined squeeze, the eagle could break a person's forearm. There were many things that I saw while visiting the National Eagle Center. If you get a chance, take a visit to the other side of the river and check it out. There are informative talks going on every day. They allow you to get very close to these beautiful creatures. They also have the gift shop at the center. And for $35 a year, you can become a member of the center, allowing you unlimited access to these animals. 